So in my real life, um, not that this is not real, but you know what I mean, in my day-to-day -day life, I should say, um, I get a lot of questions uh, from people I pass in public at the grocery store or the post office or whatnot about my eyelashes. <laughs> so um, the length of them <laughs> specifically. And so I thought I would actually share um, about what I use on them because I do use something on them. Um, I won't keep you in suspense. <laughs> um, it's this. So this is castor oil and I purchased this from Amazon and it's it costs about this is let's see two fluid ounces of cold pressed hexane free USDA organic non-gmo castor oil certified organic um, yeah and the only ingredient is organic cold pressed castor oil and so I've been using this actually for six and a half years it's now um, nightly every single night I massage it not only on my eyelashes, um, and I don't wear um, eye makeup, so um, these are my eyelashes, and they're long, they're really long, and they're thick, and they're, you know, luscious, if I do say so myself, so, but I credit that all to using castor oil for six years, and I will say in the beginning, and not that it took six years for it to get to this point, but it did take a while. If my memory serves, it took about 16 weeks for me to see any results, um, any visible results on my eyelashes. It wasn't an overnight thing and it wasn't even a one month thing or two month thing. It took a while, but um, so I'm not calling anyone a liar. If you read reviews on Amazon that they say, oh, within a week, my eyelashes were noticeably longer. I didn't have that experience, but um, it did. They did and do continue to be in great condition um, because of this, I do believe, is the reason. Um, I Anytime anyone asks me, are your eyelashes real? I say yes, and they say, what do you do? I tell them, castor oil. And I just, I massage it every single night. Just, I literally take a dab of it um, it comes in this nice dropper style pipette. So I pull up a, a bit and I take three or four drops, which is quite a bit actually. And um, this doubles as my eye cream because <laughs> I don't use eye cream either. But I dab it all around my eyes and then I proceed to massage it on my actual eyelashes. Gently, of course, but I do, um, I get really up in there. And I just go to town with the with the oil. And not only is it effective, um, clearly, but it feels really good. It feels really nice and relaxing at the end of the day. After I've, you know, removed my sunscreen and all of that, um, it just feels like a nice, because I do this every night, it, it kind of like sets me in a good way mentally if that, I know that sounds maybe odd but it does it really kind of um, it's a part of my routine that I actually look forward to um, kind of ending the day with and it's like my wind down thing is massaging my eyelashes with castor oil I know <laughs> I get really wild <laughs> but so just a quick video I wanted to share that with you because I get so many questions from people so um, sharing is caring and I'm I'm not one to keep a good secret to myself not not something like this so uh, try it out you have nothing to lose I think there are other benefits too if it's not helping your lashes it certainly conditions the skin topically um, and if, oh, I know one question that I might get asked, so I'll just answer it preemptively. It does cloud the vision because the oil inevitably seeps into the eyes. Uh, I don't mind it. And um, after six and a half years of doing this, I have not experienced any uh, adverse effects from that. And um, I know if you Google anything, there's all kinds of things that can scare people away. But um, that's when I would say that 
you know, use your own discretion. If you're not comfortable with it, then don't do it. I'm not uncomfortable with it. And uh, like I said, I have not experienced any um, bad effects, only good. So there you go. Try it out. Castor oil. Let me know how it goes if you do try it out. I'm curious. Bye.